What would happen if you dropped a nuke on New York City? Well, that's what I wanted to find out, and so in my newest video, I ran a simulation. I started off by dropping the United States' smallest bomb on New York University, where I went to school, you know, just to gauge what the fatalities would be. And fortunately, only 3,400 people died. So next, I raised the stakes to North Korea's largest nuke that they tested in 2017 at 150 kilotons. As expected, nearly 1 million people died. But we're not even close to the largest yet. I now checked out Castle Bravo, the largest US bomb ever tested at 15 megatons. I dropped it in the same spot and the death toll quadrupled to 4 million people. Even crazier was the nuclear fallout ripple effect that reached Canada. But I had to keep moving forward and so I geared up for the largest nuke in history, which is the SAR bomb, which was designed by the USSR. So I went full Oppenheimer mode and I let it rip and, well, the results were pretty crazy. Go watch the full video now because I answer the question, 